is. Sorry I couldn't make it down today. With it being exam period, I've got a lot of revision to get on with. So I'll quickly update you about London. So on Monday, me, Matt, Pav and Laura all went down to London and on the first night went for a lovely meal with Pav's family who were also lovely and we just chilled out for a bit and then when we got back to the hotel we talked a bit about what we wanted to discuss tomorrow so Blaze's successes, what it has done for us in the community I just wanted to really bring about the idea of what Blaze has done for all the young producers as well so in the morning was the event which was Legacy Trust UK's Have We Inspired a Generation debate slash discussion and it was in the Royal Society of Arts building and it first started off with um, them outlining the evaluation from all the information they gathered from interviewing I think over a thousand people across the UK and about how 2012 has impacted them. So once it discussed what they found out we could then argue or agree with what they said so it was opened up to question and answers so luckily three out of four of us got to talk to the people themselves so Matt said about how Blaze and the Olympics showed that failure and mistakes are good and that you need them to work harder and learn um, Pav talked about the success of the chase and how the lads are now getting on with doing their own training and how far they've come on by Blaze and the 2012 Olympics and myself I talked about how it was lovely to sit at home watching the sport and then wait and then wake up the next day and go over to Preston to then do the cultural Olympian side of it so we talked about the impact it had on us and then we talked a bit about what Blaze had done for us. So then the event brought around the idea of creating the same buzz and how we were going to do that and how we were going to create the same positivity in the country without another 2012 Olympics. So we talked about latching on to other events that are going to happen. So I think it's next year is the Great War. So there was talk about that and then at the end we met up with some people from any generation in the northwest um who like blaze offer opportunities to young people and it was lovely to meet like jonathan edwards who was a former olympian and baroness T tanny gray thompson a former paralympian really nice meeting some famous people and the event was indeed very interesting and inspiring as well because the ideas that were brought forward by the audience were all about benefiting people through sport and culture and I think that is what Blaze is about as well but you're, you're talking today about what else can you latch onto this year so that would be a really good idea actually to think, of, think about other things because now we don't have the 2012 Olympics people might not want to do that anymore so I think thinking of other stuff would be also really great and at the end we were given a final evaluation mm -hmm. um, I'll bring that round to the next one and Laura might have one on her and then we were given also this little plant pot I'll get it out and you can like I think the idea is that you start your your own little legacy through keeping this plant alive which I thought was absolutely lovely so I'm going to save that for university and um, yeah that, it was a great event we learned a lot of stuff and I think from going to the event it is definitely clear that 2012 has inspired a generation and I think Blaze has inspired a generation for me because without Blaze I don't know where I'd be and what I'd be doing so thank you Blaze for taking me down and I'll see you all soon. Tweet me if you need to need not need any if you need any more information and I'll try to get back to you.